what is up guys monashia and today we have an act 6 chapter 4.3 dark Hawk solo but with guillotine 2099 so this was actually quite an interesting fight for me because guillotine is one of those few champs who actually can work pretty well on this fight without needing to counter his auto block or miss mechanic Okay, so going through the nodes, he does have Raptor upgrade, which means he will start the fight in null mode and will be unblockable. But she can pretty much ignore the other nodes because she won't be using any specials in this fight, so you know, Hurt Locker or Lionheart, even Force of War won't come into play. Um, so yeah, really now the key to this fight is, first of all, you want to have your guillotine ramped up. So you want to have to finish a fight with a special 3, so you can start with 100 hits on your combo meter. And then now uh, you want to activate two of her pre-fight abilities, particularly the stability function, because you are going to be taking a lot of block damage, and the assault function, because the power burn is pretty essential to getting this fight done. Okay, so I'm going to go in, and here I just missed time to intercept, uh, but unfortunately I had the big fury synergy, so it's all good. So yeah, I'm kind of just um, waiting out the unblockable, and then once it's done, I will be able to parry. So yeah, if you're not really great at intercepting, you can just wait it out, you know, maybe hit his block a few times, just to give yourself some space. But yeah, once it's over, then you can parry and do a full combo. So you notice that Guillotine's power burn activates on her medium attacks. So the key to actually getting this fight done with her is to always end your combo with a medium attack, as you usually would. Also make sure you don't use any special attacks because then you will knock him down and then you'll go into the auto block mode. Okay, so now the strategy for this fight is basically you want to do something that I like to call medium baiting or combo baiting. Where basically you're gonna sort of just alternate between holding block and being in neutral. And by neutral I mean just not pressing anything at all, just leave your channel to be idle for a few split seconds. And basically what that will do is, because you're holding block, your opponent is a lot less likely to throw a special attack. You know, just like how you wouldn't throw a special attack when the opponent is blocking, unless you're unblockable of course. But yeah, this will basically prompt the opponent to dash at you while you're blocking. And basically, because you keep on alternating between holding block and not blocking, you can actually get in a parry, then you do a full combo. And because the medium attacks burn power, Dark Hawk will never get to 3 bars of power. So typically you would drop a full combo and then dash back once or twice, hold block for a second, let go, you know, keep doing that until he dashes at you. And because the block damage is pretty high, you want to make sure that you are indeed parrying instead of just blocking until he throws a heavy attack. And that's why you kind of just do this alternating thing, because when you let go of your block, that's when you will have an opportunity to parry when he dashes at you. And this is generally a technique I use with Dr. Doom, because you want your opponent to have as much power as you can before you steal it. So after doing a 5 hit combo, you want to go for the parry, but you'll notice that he will often just stand there and hold block. And that's when you want to just dash back once or twice, hold block for a second, let go and repeat until he dashes at you. And that will basically give you an opportunity to parry his medium attack. So sometimes you will throw the occasional special attacks here and there. And then when he does throw the special 2 and goes into stealth mode, I sort of just like to wait it out because he can cause your medium and light attacks to miss. So usually I'll just hold block most of the time to prevent him from throwing a special attack while waiting for stealth mode to end. And then it's back to that cycle. And I know I've already explored Act 6, but I still tend to revisit it from time to time just to test certain interactions and mechanics. Also, I just find it fun, because to be honest, Act 6 Chapter 4 is one of my favorite pieces of content in this game. So I do tend to go back just to, you know, test out some champs and stuff. Because also, it's just a very relevant piece of endgame content with a variety of challenging fights. And for this one, I kind of just wanted to test how effective Guillotine's power burn would be in a fight like this. And I know a lot of people regard this Dark Hawk as the most annoying boss in Act 6 Chapter 4. Especially if you don't have some of the best counters that counter either his auto block or miss, such as Human Torch, Nick Fury, Stout Spidey, Aegon, Corvus. But I also just like finding alternative ways to do things, and this is one of them. So yeah, I hope you guys found this interesting, thank you for watching, have a wonderful day, and I'll see you soon.